The origin of life. The natural process by which life has arisen from non-living matter. Prokaryote. A single-celled organism that lacks a nucleus and other membrane-bound organelles. Besides the absence of a nucleus, prokaryotes also lack mitochondria. Cyanobacteria. Phylum of gram-negative bacteria that obtain energy via photosynthesis. They appear to have originated in a freshwater or terrestrial environment. Eukaryote. A diverse domain of organisms whose cells have a nucleus. Chuanoflagellate. A group of free-living unicellular and colonial flagellate eukaryotes considered to be the closest living relatives of the animals. Platyhelminthes, simple bilaterian, unsegmented, soft-bodied invertebrates. Pacaya, an extinct primitive chordate animal. Hyquichthys, an extinct genus of craniate that lived 525 million years ago. Agnatha, an infraphylum of jawless fish in the phylum chordata, subphylum vertebrata. Placodermy, a class of armored prehistoric fish known from fossils which lived from the Silurian to the end of the Devonian period. Placoderms were among the first jawed fish. Cephalaspis, a possibly monotypic genus of extinct osteostracan agnathan vertebrate. It was a trout-sized detritivorous fish that lived in the early Devonian, was heavily armored, presumably to defend against predatory placoderms and eurypterids. Coelacanth, fish belonging to the order Actinistia, Tiktaalik, a monospecific genus of extinct Sarcopterygian from the late Devonian period, having many features akin to those of four-legged animals. Acanthostega, an extinct genus of stem tetrapod, among the first vertebrate animals to have recognizable limbs. It appeared in the late Devonian period about 365 million years ago. Ichthyostega, an extinct genus of limbed tetrapodomorphs from the late Devonian of Greenland. It was among the earliest four-limbed vertebrates in the fossil record. Heinerpeten, an extinct genus of early four-limbed vertebrate that lived in the rivers and ponds of Pennsylvania during the late Devonian period. West Lothiana, a genus of reptile-like tetrapod that lived during the latest part of the Visean age of the Carboniferous, a superficial resemblance to modern-day lizards. Hylonymus, an extinct genus of reptile that lived 300 million years ago during the late Carboniferous period. The earliest unquestionable reptile. Thinosuchus, an extinct genus of therapsids from the Middle Permian of Russia. Thinosuchus is the sole member of the family Thinosuchidae. Synognathus, an extinct genus of large-bodied synodontian therapsids that lived in the Middle Triassic. Fossils have so far been recovered from South Africa, Argentina, Antarctica, and Namibia. Repinomimus, a genus of opossum to badger-sized gobiconodontid. Fossils was found in China. Jeremiah, an extinct genus of very basal eutherian mammal known from the late Jurassic deposits of western Liaoning, China. Plesiodopus, one of the oldest known primate-like mammal genera. Plesiodopus tricuspidens, the type specimen, is named after the three cusps present on its upper incisors. Egyptopithecus, an early fossil catarrhine that predates the divergence between hominoids and cercopithecids. Proconsul, an extinct genus of primates that existed from 25 million years ago during the Miocene epoch. Fossil remains are present in eastern Africa, including Kenya and Uganda. Sivapithecus, a genus of extinct apes. Aurorin, a postulated early species of hominini discovered in 2000. Its discovery was used to argue against the hypothesis that Australopithecines are human ancestors. Ardipithecus, a genus of an extinct hominin that lived during the late Miocene and early Pliocene epochs in the Afar Depression, Ethiopia. Australopithecus, a genus of early hominins that existed in Africa during the late Pliocene and early Pleistocene. Homo erectus, an extinct species of archaic human from the Pleistocene, with its earliest occurrence about two million years ago. Neanderthal, an extinct species or subspecies of archaic humans who lived in Eurasia. Neanderthal technology was quite sophisticated. It includes the Mousterian stone tool industry and ability to create fire. Homo sapiens are the most abundant and widespread species of primate. 
They are a type of great ape who are characterized by bipedalism and exceptional cognitive skills due to a large and complex brain. As such, social interactions between humans have established a wide variety of values, social norms, language, and rituals, each of which bolster human society. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and click bell icon to get new video updates. See you in the next video.